It has been nearly 40 years since the groundbreaking miniseries Roots captivated American audiences right here on ABC. And now the story is being retold for a whole new generation. Nightline's Byron Pitt sat down with the cast who opened up about their powerful project. For eight consecutive nights in January 1977, a record-breaking 140 million Americans watched the captivating miniseries Roots on ABC. Kunta Kinte. Oh, no, that's your African name. Must have given you a new name. The now iconic program follows several generations of the lives of a family enslaved in the South, shining a well-needed light on an aspect of American history. A young African warrior named Kunta Kinte. Ah! and sparking pointed conversations across the country. You can't imagine that people, your ancestors, would do this stuff. And now, almost 40 years later, Roots has been redone for a new generation. No eye has seen a bird such as this. The four-episode series premieres tonight on the History Channel, and I got a chance to sit down with the cast. When I watched the original 1977, it made me angry and proud. And when I watch your version, it made me angrier and prouder. Why take on this project? Because it's necessary to continue to tell this story, the glory of what Africa was. I grew up in Zimbabwe in Africa, and this route certainly has one of the most respectful and ambitious portrayals of African history. You see it as, as an African story. For many of us, we see it as an American story. Yes, it's an American story, but it's also it would be disingenuous to pretend that we can tell the story, the history of America, without also telling the, the history of Africans, mm -hmm. because it is absolutely intertwined. Toby. Quinta Kente. I am London-born, second-generation Jamaican, and one of the biggest things that I took from playing Quinta Kinte is where his strength came from was in knowing where he was from and holding on to that. Irish-born actor Jonathan Rees Myers plays the brutal slave owner Tom Lee, who fathers a child with one of his slaves. These guys were the part that made you proud. I was the part that made you angry. Oh, no, brother, your part pissed me off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What the hell do you know about children? May I ask what you did to prepare yourself to play such a dark character? I accepted it from the moment I got there that I would be the villain, and I had to be as brutal as I could possibly be. Otherwise, I would be dishonest and disrespectful to the material. Is there a moment in your performance that was particularly difficult? I think definitely for me, the hardest day with its own respect was the whipping scene because of the original and it just being so iconic. What do you want people to take from this? One of my prayers for this is that this would bring about a sense of healing and clarity. For Good Morning America, Byron Pitts, ABC News, New York. Wow. Powerful indeed. Roots airs tonight on History.